All right, I'm done with this fucking vlog. We're done. Episode's over. Stop, think, listen to your heart. Don't be scared. Hey, get street smart. Okay, we're actually gonna be smart and record this ahead of time. Yeah. And actually plan this out. So what are we watching, Frank? Oh, what are we watching? We're watching Get Smart, A Kid's Guide to Stranger Danger. Okay. Which is essentially Alien gets molested a bunch of times over and then the special ends. <laughs> it's basically the plot of what happens. That sounds great. Let's watch. Greetings, Earthling! Great news! Capricorn, America's favorite alien exchange student, is starring in some other new fun educational Capricorn? films. Yes, Capricorn. Stop, think, listen Capstone to Entertainment and Safe Kids have created a whole series of Capricorn's adventures. Are you all right, Brandon? Like you about all kinds of Frank? Like Corny? And Don't miss Corny? Future movies. Corny. And remember, oh, fuck you, Frank. No Lovely. It's a Star no, Wars. Star Wars. <laughs> it's a Star Wars. <laughs> it is just Star Wars. It's just Star Wars. Oh. Who gives a fuck? Oh, I'm trying. CI8. He's too bad strangers and evil kidnappers. Corny's mission is to learn what it means to be straight smart and teach all the kids in the universe how to make the planet safer. His time has come. May the cosmos be with him. Oh, f you. <laughs> I'm joking on Blockboard. There's hey, one. May the cosmos be with you. <laughs> You're right. Good. Oh, hey, look. Marvin the Martian. Your birdie from 236 explosive. I can't do it. Explosive space modulator. Oh. Where's the kaboom? There's supposed to be an earth shattering kaboom. Ugh. Magic fingers. Oh, is he having an orgasm? <laughs> what the f is he doing under that bed? Oh. His antenna. Is this f Mario music going on in the background? Like Paper Mario shit? I don't know. Why is this man mowing my lawn? Last into orbit, son? Duh, Dad! Duh? Does not compute. Does not compute. Does not compute. Is, is, is the dad a robot? Want an energy pack, Capricorn? Oh, no thanks, Mama. I'll just have one of these. Oh, that's a good boy, Capricorn. Goldfish make your skin nice and scaly. Good old goldfish set snacks. Yeah, I'm, I'm going back for that one. Yep. Look at this. Then kick it into warp speed. Left. I mean, right. Want some candy, kid? Oh, no thanks. It rots my ears. You want some candy, Brandon? Get the land, kid! Yeah. Well, you know. Hi. Hey, where are you going? On your way to school? See? He likes me. Hello. Interesting boy. Uh, where do you come from? That yellow house over there. Nice. You never give out personal information to a stranger. Stranger, Corny. Do you have any clue about strangers? Yeah. Green, mean, and hairy with a big red eye right here. Yeah. That's the boogeyman, Corny. But our strangers can be very nice and very friendly. Most are, but if you are Not even close. But Not even close. Sure well, if a stranger bothered me, I'd, I'd poke him in the eye. I'd zap him in the nose. 
I am real. You can't drop kick a 200 pound man. He didn't say drop kick, first of all. Look, I've got insurance. My fail safe device. It just zaps me away. Awesome. Then I guess we don't have to worry about you anymore. Well, you're a dick, kid. Already you've got your disappointed face on, Frank. And if you were listening, you would know the three rules that can save your life. Capricorn, safety rule number one is... Correct. The buddy system. Always stay with a buddy. Even when you visit the public bathroom. Now okay, I that buddy. teacher is a moron. First of all, also, can I just say... Does it appear that 90% of the adults in this town are pedophiles? Lucia, what's the second rule? Yes. Follow your gut feelings. Oh my god. Lady. No. I don't think I have any guts. Anyway, what's a gut feeling? It's like radar, Carney. It's just in your heart. It's a funny feeling. Like something isn't right. You can't trust someone. It's like something inside of you is saying, no way, Jose. I get it. Don't trust Mexicans. My gut says this guy has candy. So practice being... Capricorn. Remember, kids, trust your heart. It will always tell you when something... You know, funny antenna jokes. Funny antenna jokes, Frank. Funny... I'm sorry, Brandon. Funny penis joke. That'd be more funny. Because it's, it's about molestation. Great. A shortcut. A shortcut. Okay, Corny, Corny is literally just the biggest no, dumbass no, in the world. No, you put that on the other side. What? No. That does you no good. You have the sign on the f***. I'm about being a streetwalker. God damn it, Frank. Ooh. Um. Um. Hey, you know what? Equal rights. It's a picture of my puppy. He's lost. Can you help me find him? Oh, I just know I'm never gonna see him again. That is from the, the internet. Poor lady. This must be that gut feeling. What would Jesus do? What the hell is this? Why are they kidnapping him? I don't know, he's an alien? They're gonna chop him up and sell him? You can jump out of the truck. You can, you can jump out of the truck. You're not stuck in the truck. They haven't tied you down. Oh! Where does he go? Oh. Seizure! Oh, what the f***? Oh shit, he's still jerking it. <laughs> so yes, this is Groundhog Day. This is just Groundhog Day. God, it is Groundhog Day. Yep. Yeah. yeah, he's gonna step on the cat again. Nope. Fuck you. Oh, there it is. There it is. Ugh. You're not getting too much material from this video, are you? No. No, this is gonna be a short ass video. Yeah. Wait, here's where's the guy where's the candy jeep guy? Yeah. How many Mondays are there? One, duh. There's only one Monday, guys. Only one ever. We did it once. How many of you like to fish? I like fish. Capricorn, would you please sit in your desk? Oh. Strangers like 
Genius, Brandon. Genius comedy you just pulled. Strangers like to fish for children. You, your kids, and your Johnson. And aliens. Parking lots. Like ghouls. Strangers are like ghouls. All they do is sit in shadows and wait to snatch you up. Who do you think kidnappers look for? When convicts were asked, what do you think they said? Space cadets? Right. Children who don't pay attention. Who appear out of control. Tuned out. My god, this guy deserves to get killed. He is a dumbass. Yeah, like he's doing it again. Why doesn't he... Loners. F you if you have no friends. Mm. You know that stuff about not calling attention to ourselves? Yeah, like not wearing our names on our stuff? Check that out. Corny, you're walking latch key advertising. <laughs> Inside your shirt. Hey, Corny. How you doing, bud? Hey. <laughs> See you around, bud. See, now he knows your name. Yeah, he must be my friend. Some friend. Do you know his name? He's pretending to be your friend to trick you. Don't ah. trust him. Ha. I'm too big to be tricked. I'm too big to be kidnapped, Frank. Yeah, you remember when they used to do that in like um, safety specials? It's like. Develop seven secret codes that only your family know. Capricorn, your mother's been hurt in an accident. She sent me to come get you. Get in the car. Oh no, my mom. I better help her. You're so stupid. His fingers are too big to hit the wall. Okay. This is genius. Genius comedy. Hi, Grandma. Genius comedy? Genius comedy? It's genius comedy, Frank. It's not genius comedy. It's genius comedy, Frank. It's not genius comedy. Yes, it is. Except when you're wrong, Frank. It's genius. It's not genius quality. Help me trick. Help, Help me, me trick. trick. Bribe trick. Bribe trick. Make you famous trick. Make you famous trick. Emergency trick. He's in the dungeon. What is this, a fucking cult? They're detailing all the magic spells that strangers can use to lure you in into their, their snare. Okay, what kidnapper trick is this? Hi, you want to come and play with me? Spinning games trick. Gotcha. In you go to the dungeon with my first victim. <laughs> you really wanted that dollar I offered you, didn't you, Corny? What trick is that? Bribery? Right. <laughs> what if I wore an official policewoman's uniform and said, come with me? Official uniform trick. That's a very specific name. What? So wait. If it's, if a random cop comes up to you, don't trust them. They might not be a cop. And also, make sure there's someone else in that vicinity that you can ask. Hey, do you know if this is a cop? Yeah, cause they, cause they know every cop in their town. Exactly. Especially if there's a million people. Frank looks so disappointed. Looks like Gary Shandling's dad. 
fall for any of those kidnap tricks. Hey, kid. Can you help me out? I gotta push my car over to the gas station. I'll let you steer. He'll let me steer? Is steering that important, Crank? I just call him Crank. I called him Crank. Pull the lever, Crank! <laughs> I know every, every... Every adult in this town that isn't the teacher or the parents are kidnappers. Yeah. Genius comedy? I take it back, Frank, you were right. Genius comedy, Frank? Not genius comedy. You guys, you gotta listen to me. I got kidnapped. No shirt, so where are you? They dream on Zarkon too, I guess. No, I really did! Three times! First by a lady who lost her dog. Then by a lady who said my mom was sick. And then yesterday by a guy who let me steer his car. Sure, who let a kid drive? Swear to Zarkon! Swear to Zarkon! Swear to Zarkon! Swear to me, swear to Zarkon, Brandon. Fuck you. I swear to Zarkon. Man, Corny's an idiot, isn't he? Oh, here's the wonderful musical montage. Ah! Chokes him out. Oh, this part. Ah, ah. <laughs> oh, this is genius. Watch this. <laughs> the old yeah the old throw it into a bush and trap them yeah ugh Oh. How come, hmm? How come this guy like remembers him every day? Like it's like he does the continuum with Corny. He's like some interdimensional rape demon. Yeah. Also, isn't this not the most like generic tra Oh, watch this. This editing hurts me. Does no one freak out about the fact that there's a fucking alien guy? No. Frank, this is normal, right? Yeah, I mean, you know Jerry? He's an alien. Exactly. Good old Jerry. Oh yeah, Jerry. Yeah, we, we don't see we don't see that guy anymore, do we? Yeah. Yeah, I think he went back to where he was. Where is he from? Omicron Percy I8, I believe. It oh was. yeah, that. Mm. You all have permission to be rude and loud. Make a scene. Yeah! 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 You probably will, seeing as you're such a colossal f up. Oh, here he goes. Oh, 
This guy again. No, 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 no. Hey, talk to me for a while. Maybe, uh, maybe we can get some ice cream. Uh, uh, I don't know. Well, here, uh, maybe this gum will make you feel better. Thanks. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Why don't you know that guy's actually like a really nice guy? Mm. Can you also just point out the fact that he went through all that and he still ate the fucking candy that he gave him? Load gun. Call mom and dad. Secure bomb shelter. Is everything okay? You sound funny. Oh, well, um, I lost my zapper. Oh, you'll be fine. Just don't answer the phone unless it rings twice. Stop, then rings twice again. You know our code. So let the answering machine take the call. I'll let dad know you're home safe. And remember, don't let strangers into the house. Okay. A very simple rule. How much my wife's gonna f it up? Yeah, it's corny. It's pretty much expected of him. Listen for the cold. Hello? Stupid! Now, what would you say that wasn't me? My mother is in the shower, and my dad is mowing the lawn. What? Did he put the phone in the freezer? He did. He did do that, didn't he, Frank? Don't answer the door. How stupid is this guy? Who is it? Delivery. Um. Uh, it's it's Donald Trump Jr. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me that's not him. And pretty much is. <laughs> Don't. Dumbass. I'm sorry. I can't open the door. You'll have to come back later, please. I did it. I did it. I'm straight smart. Oh, fuck. I thought I told you to come back later. Corny. Uh. No. Use the force. Stop. Think. Listen to your heart. Don't be a man street smart. Oh, hi. What are you doing? I've been watching you for days. I know every move you make, and your parents too. For days. He for does travel with him. He's the one guy who doesn't go through the time war. Oh, shit. He's, he literally is an intergalactic rape demon or something. You be good, you won't get hurt. You give me trouble, I'm gonna come back and take care of your parents. Too. Oh my god, this got really dark all of a sudden. Oh, oh, the bike. Oh. The police got there really fucking fast, dude. Mm. The hell is he doing? He's not my father. He's a kidnapper. How'd you get here so fast? My mom called us to check your house. That's a great parent who follows her gut feelings. What do you normally do when he gets home? No, you're not. You open no, you're the door not. To the fucking guy. You open. You open your door. Your mom has to call the cops for you. Let's telegraph it, Brandon. That's the rule of film. It's a brand new day. Thanks, mom. You're the best. Now remember, I compute, Bob. I compute. Capricorn, you okay? Out of sight. 
That's a wonderful face you just made. <laughs> I'm the best at faces. Yeah. He's not gonna trip on the bike today. Trips on his face anyway. Little boy, you shouldn't talk to strangers. What a f Please. up. Brandon? Don't talk to strangers, kids. Except for Uncle Brandon. Uncle Brandon's safe. Little girl. Oh, you sh head. Corny, my name is Aaron Tate. My phone number is 237-4543. And my parents' names are Karen and David Tate. This kid's even worse. I know everything about safety. What if a grown-up asks you for help? What should you do? Tell him to ask another grown-up. What if a repairman says there's a dangerous gas leak in your apartment building? What should you do? I don't live in an apartment building. Ha! Yeah. Frank? Have you learned anything, Frank? Just leave it at that. I don't know. Brandon, have you learned anything? Has cor has Capricorn imbued knowledge to you about strangers? Don't be stupid. Mm. What are they looking at? Us. They're staring at us, Brandon. Stranger danger. They're I making the know these kids. They are making the connection. Miami connection. <laughs> Fuck you. After a week of fucking up. After like multiple weeks. Mm. His parents. Wait, it's his, it's his job to teach people how to be safe. His quest. Okay. So basically, the he only- sent the most incompetent child to do the job. Not, not, not the parents, the child. To be continued? How about no? F I see it as this. They sent the most incomparable f up to teach the people simply as a don't be like this guy. Example. That's his only purpose. Alright, episode's done. F 